Okay, so we're here. Fooster's going to be our model again. We're going to talk about the placement of the bit in a horse's mouth and what is the proper way to place a bit in a horse's mouth. We have our running roan tack head stall. These are very good usable head stalls. They're pretty, of course. All of us girls got to have pretty head stalls. And, and men, sorry, men have to have fancy stuff too. We like shiny. You can go to runningroantack.com to purchase this. It's very usable. It, it works really good. It's great leather, great quality. All right, so let's talk about our bit placement here. What is, how do I make this horse have the correct bit placement to make my bit work properly? And it's very important that you pay attention to this detail because if your bit is not placed properly in a horse's mouth, it will not function. Okay, so the way I have this leverage bit, because the porches is so short, and we'll talk about that more in a different video, is why, what's the difference right here on the purchase and what kind of reaction you get and why you choose a bit that's shorter or longer in the purchase. So I wouldn't consider this a big gag bit because the ring is so small here. So as you can see, I have one wrinkle in Fooster's mouth. Now it's very important that you look at where this bit lays on his mouth. It's not too tight. It's sitting just right. It's sitting right over the top of his tongue. It's not hanging down here. When I help people, I see their bits or sometimes when you look at the gag bit, it's hanging like way down here on a horse's mouth. So you do not want that to be like that. So you want to be sure and pull this bit up where there's one or two wrinkles. And, and, and when you have a bigger, uh, your bit can move more right here in, in this little circle right here. I know there's a proper name for it, um, but I'm going to call it the little half circle on this reverse gag. So when you have a smaller one, you only wanna have about one wrinkle, but you wanna make sure that this bit is placed properly when you look inside your horse's lips. You wanna make sure that it's not hanging down here on his tongue and it's placed properly so the proper reaction time, you have a faster reaction time. So we have one wrinkle here. If this had a bigger circle right here, I would want him to kinda of smile because I want that reaction, because this is quick, you know, see how quick that bit is? If you had a bigger circle, you could see where this slows down. All right, so then you want to pull this up. If you have a bigger circle or you have a more of a, of a, of a movement here, you want to be sure and pull this up where this horse is kind of smiling. With this bit, I don't need to do that. Okay, well, we'll see you down the road. If you have any questions, you, should, you can text me at 254-592-2041. You can go to our website at JNC Bits. You can email us through there, or you can go to our Facebook page, JNC Bits, or you can go to Instagram, J underscore C underscore Bits. Thank you again. See you down the road. <music>